Hi guys, welcome to the channel Info Hub with Santasha. My name is Bitumelo Tumi Santasha. Welcome everybody to my channel. <laughs> welcome, welcome guys. Thank you so much for the sub, the like, the comments, and everything in between. All right. So today I'll be showing you all how to apply at Spark Schools under 10 minutes. So today we are going to apply for one vacancy that is available at Spark Schools. Let's see how it goes. So you'll go to their website and get to the home page and then you go to careers, you go to join team, uh, you click there. All right, my internet's a bit slow. And then you click on join team. And then you'll go to the Spark Schools careers and then you have to scroll down. Scroll down, scroll down. And then you will see um, Spark School Careers. What are we looking for? What can we do for your career? ATM players. You see all those things. And then you go to your application tips. So what should I include in my application? So I advise you to read these first so that to know, you know what type of a school is Spark Schools and all that. So you can just read that information. So that when you answer the application, you're answering based on, you know, aligned to what they want. And then you will read as well what they want in the application. You know, so all applications must be reviewed and all that. What will happen in the phone interview? So they tell you all the information that it lasts for 10 to 15 minutes and all that. And then... If you are successful, they'll let you know via um, email for a in-person interview and all that. So you can just read all the uh, information. Um, I like that. So it helps you to prepare. So you'll go to Workable Career uh, page. That is where you see all the vacancies, all the available posts. And my network is low. <laughs> all right. Okay, come on. Okay, it's still loading and then you see there is a view jobs all right so just down below you see our vision in south africa uh, is south africa leads global education you know at spa schools we employ individuals who are who display the core characteristics you know and then you read all that i think it's extremely important to know the vision of the school you know think it helps when you are applying you, you you know the type of culture they all about you know as a collaboration because getting south africa to lead the global education you no know, it takes team effort so you have to read and all know and uh, know all that and then they also have the their video there's the ceo of spark schools that you know tells us about the vision they have for spark all right so you'll click to view jobs so you have the option to filter based on the um if you want maybe in job and how only or in the west western cape only you can filter that or you can just apply if, if you're willing to thingy to relocate as you can see there are posts from seven days ago four days ago six days ago you can go to location if let's say I don't want to relocate, then I'll choose South Africa Gauteng and then it will pick up vacancies that are only based for Gauteng and then we go to department, am I applying for high school only, am I applying for primary, then I'll choose the my field, you know, if I can do both, I guess I leave it like that, so for this one I can say maybe high school uh, vacancies and then it will filter everything as you can see these are like posts from like 14 days ago 17 days ago 19 days ago and then they state whether it's for full-time or part-time you know 
so yeah let's click on high school mathematical sciences educator so we click them and then let's see it's gonna load and load and load and load and then there you go high school math uh, mathematical uh, sciences educator and then spark schools 2023 and then you will see so before you can start with the application you can just read through uh the purpose um, purpose of role the requirements you know so that you understand thoroughly what the school requires uh from you you know and i'm not saying if you feel like oh you don't meet the requirements you don't apply you know yeah if your faith is saying apply regardless of whether you do have the you meet the requirements or not then do so then do so honey so you'll uh, read through and you see what your responsibilities are to plan to teach you know to engage in extra curriculum activities to do all that you know to lead a social a scholar social and emotional development through all that so you read all through what they would require for you from you rather you know and you don't want to be working there and then you are surprised when they saying you must do one two three you like i will but i did not you know so you read through all the responsibilities and then they have the qualifications and criteria so you need to be fluent in english you need to have completed a b-ed or pgc in and then in these in that uh, particular subject with this which is uh, mathematics with this example and then you have you have to be uh, says registered yeah and then have a you know clear criminal record these are the qualities that they need you know excellence huh? a track record of high expectations personally and professionally you know and these are your benefits mm. So these are your benefits over there, you know, employee wellness support. I love that. You have your funeral cover, life disability and funeral cover, you know. Yeah, I, I love that. I love that. Employee discount on school fees, you know. When you just, when you decide to have babies, they just all go to Sparks because, ah, discount. And then that is the compensation for you. That is 25K, 25,000 rands. And you see the different locations that they need the, the teacher. So you would either go to Rivonia, uh, River Sands, or Runbeck. And then you click on apply for this job. If you feel like, yeah, this is me, this is mine, this is speaking to me. You click to it and then it loads again, loads and loads and loads. And then you can either uh, autofill uh the the application by importing your resume so you can just click on that and then it will do the things for you or you can uh, enter all your details manually all right your name your surname your email address so for the purposes of safety and everything i won't be filling in any information but i just want to show you how it looks like you know don't be scared thinking that you know you have to go there one thing i like about spark school that they're not so hyped about they actually do not have like hand delivery so you do everything online i love that about them because you are saving time you are saving paper you're saving trees you know you don't have to you don't have to do all that you can just upload your certified docus and you are all good you know you don't have to go from pillar to post just to, to apply for one post guys yo all right so you will select the spark high school you are applying for and then you enter all your your DL ids you click whether you have a valid uh, thingy criminal record and you enter all the details that they require from you and you have to motivate while you are applying for the post so you need to think thoroughly on this one and the years of experience that you have and then you yeah you need to think thoroughly on that and then remember their vision remember the requirements they have from you and then that will help you to you know to to write the correct uh, one and and then you submit your application and then you are done and then you allow do you know anyone working at spark schools and what is their relation to them you know is it your aunt is it your mom cool you know wh what is it or no one and then yeah you are done and you sub submit your application 
simple like that you know very very simple okay so let's i want to go back a bit so that i can show you let's say if there aren't any you no know, the uh, the current rather uh, vacancies they do not have it's not for your particular um teaching field so you can go back to the main page on um the career at spark schools you will scroll down scroll down you will scroll down scroll down scroll down and then you see all those uh, jobs that are currently available and then down below you uh, can find the right row and then yeah you can see that is a post for me <laughs> okay you can click on show more and then you can scroll down you see the western cape rosebank Gauteng. Rosebank Gauteng, primary school english uh, teacher english english maths maths math math or oh, creative arts okay l o yeah you know though it's 15 days ago one thing i don't know it's where do you see if a post is filled or like the closing date i'm not sure about that one then you can scroll down you can see yes geography teacher that is me that was 19 days ago i wanna deem lona oh geography or history teacher 19 days ago let us see what we get here and then you know the same setup the overview you read the purpose the responsibilities and all that okay so now i want to show you if you aren't getting maybe your geography post if you are a geography teacher that you can um submit your cv so i've done this so i'm still waiting for that special wonderful call i have completed this before now let's check out their page you know so we scroll down scroll down scroll down and then we go to can find the right role email your uh, your resume to and then that is the email address that you have to email the resume to so that you be con uh, considered for new positions or you can simply click on the email my resume and then it will direct you to a different page right and then you know, the email thing will pop up so yeah i'm not gonna do that now because i have done it before so yep guys this is how you apply at spa schools under just 10 minutes all right so please do not forget to comment like and hit the sub 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 button bye and take care